good morning. It is now Thursday. It's snowy outside and I have to go to the gym for the first time in three months. Didn't go, I stopped going in December. At the beginning of December is the last time I went. Didn't go in December, didn't go in January, didn't go uh, any time this month. So I've done zero physical exercise. I have eaten like a champion this entire time. So today's the first day that I go to the gym. I gotta water my bamboo trees. Um, uh, yeah, lots to do today, okay? I have uh, all my fishing stuff right here because I wasn't sure if I needed a pole or a reel and I need a reel instead of a pole and I got a pole. So I'm, I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna go return this one, exchange it for a, for a reel and then today, as soon as I am done watering my plants, because yes, I water my plants, I gotta set up the new iMac. Now, you may say to me, Hex, you're the stupidest. Why did you buy, why did you spend so much money on on a, on a inferior computer? Final Cut 10 is the reason. That along with the fact that I've been using Mac since 2010, and when I stream, record, or do any of this stuff, I use a PC, an actual gaming PC. For work, I use a Mac uh, because I'm used to the to the operating system. I'm used to what it does. I can predict what it does. So yeah, that's 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 why. Okay, so please hold your judgments. Okay, we got to set this up. What I didn't take into account is the fact that I'm gonna to have to transfer all of the data from my old computer onto this one. The problem here, well, I guess the solution, okay? Because I know I know what not to do anymore, so I'm always gonna have 200 gigabytes of just free, free space, which is pretty much what I need in order to continue to have everything that I've had in the past, including photos and, and all that stuff, all right? So, so that's the good thing. The bad thing is that it's gonna take, I don't know, close to like, seven to eight hours um, which is fine because I have my laptop and I've been using my laptop for the first, for the last two days so I'm kind of used to it therefore it's not gonna be that big of a deal although I would have loved to have been able to use uh, the Mac to edit tonight but I'm not gonna be able to anyway uh, I've spoken too much I have to I'm in a rush I have to go pick up Mike and Embos at 845 to go to the gym for the first time to get the swole on We gotta go. Gotta get the camera. I'm gonna leave my laptop here because it's gonna force me to come back. Phone. First time digital SLR owner and individual content creator who wants to raise their game and have more on these new pro. The last couple of weeks, pretty much since I, I, I started vlogging consistently every single day, I've been considering doing and getting a big DSLR, as I mentioned in my, uh, in my Ohio video. A new camera just got released, which is the Canon 80D. Uh, Casey Neistat uses a 70D, which is an autofocus. I think Nature has a 70D, and, uh, and other people have it. I was thinking of, if I get one, this is my problem though, I, I, don't, I don't think that I'm ready or I'm that committed to the vlog yet to have that big of a contraption following me or carrying it with me at all times. And I'm not saying that I have to because I have the point to shoot, but you know what I'm saying. So, who the fuck are these guys? I've been sitting here for like 10 minutes watching this video. It's really, the video's seven, but I've been here for like at least 15 minutes, so it's time to go get them. Ready? Yeah. Is Bo's coming? Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. What's up, man? Nine o'clock, boy. Yeah, I'm tired, bro. Just got to the gym with these young fellers. Damn, day one? Wait, why are you using day, day one? one? Day one. What do you mean, please, learn? You don't know? Come on, boss. Be a visionary, boy. Get that shit. Let's go, boss. Let's go, man. You backing it again with the white bands? Oh, Hex is for sure peaking tomorrow on leg day. Oh, he gonna hate it. I might oversleep tomorrow. Whoa! Like oh! Like that. Bro, I legit feel like throwing up. Holy fuck. Anyway, that's what day one's supposed to feel like, boys. If you ain't puking on your first day back, you didn't do it right. Your body couldn't even handle it. Look, listen, I'm an expert. <laughs> of, of taking long breaks, working out for a little bit, and then, so I know. All right, uh, I'm gonna take them home. I'm gonna go to Best Buy and buy the cameras needed for the podcast. 
You know those times when you look at your gas gauge and it says, it literally says range zero, zero, zero miles. You know, getting gas to me is probably like the biggest pain in my anus, especially because it's cold and I have to stand outside because this particular one stops and goes. But I wanted to take this time to, to tell you guys that although we're spending a lot of money on the podcast, it's not the way to do it. Let me tell you what I mean by that. Um, obviously, you know, that, that's a lot of money to spend on a podcast, right? And, and, and the only reason that we're doing it is because I want the podcast to be the best possible thing. But as you guys saw in the first episode of the podcast, we didn't wait to have like the perfect setup to do it. I messed up and I only bought two mics thinking that it was gonna be enough. It wasn't, so I went out and bought another one. If I didn't have those mics, we would have used whatever we had there. We would have used our Astro microphones. But the podcast needed to get out because it, it needed to be a thing. Um, the entire beginning of my career, all of the top five, kill, top five kill camps, to give you an idea, had a total of around 40 to 50 million views as a series throughout its lifespan, all right? Um, I don't know why Machinima took them down, but one of them had close to seven million, the other ones had like five million. Like, individuals, individual episodes had that many views. Now, I don't know why I stopped doing them, but it, it, there's neither here or there. What I'm saying though is that all of those were recorded with a $3 rock band microphone that Judith bought at a garage sale. And I used that for literally like two years, from 2009 all the way to like the end of 2010. And, and that's when I bought like the Yeti. I, I made a video about three years ago when I started when I started posting like my graffiti sketches. Everybody in the comment section said, hey, what, what, what markers are you using? What markers are you using? And I said, the markers doesn't matter, right? If you, the markers don't matter. If you have something to create, use whatever it is that you have. Besides, you know, like the markers that I had were like $2.50 each marker. And I've talked about the markers in graffiti at least 10 times, or every single time that I, that I upload a video about graffiti or, or with a graffiti sketch. Everybody's always like wondering like what you do or what kind of markers you're using. Just because you have the same utensils that I have are not gonna make me good. Trust me, I have graffiti artist friends that are, that are, you know, they have got that have God-given talent, a talent that I will never ever be able to replicate. No matter how hard I try, it is something that you're never gonna be able to. Artists, singers, uh, any of that, like that's not something that you learn. You you can learn how to draw, but you will never be as good as a natural artist, right? My friend Omens. Uh, who's who's been like a mentor to me when it comes to the art world or, or, or the graffiti world and, and, and art it, as in general not just graffiti like that dude is just I, No matter how hard for the rest of my life if I quit everything that I do everything that I do and just focused on drawing and, and, and developing my art skills I will never be able to be as good as him one art is subjective Two, if you're natural, you're gonna be able to draw whatever it is that, that exists. I'm really good at drawing letters. I'm really good at putting colors together. But if you told me to draw a face, it would literally take me a year to get one thing done to make it at least decent looking. Artists are, are literally touched by God and said, you are gonna be a very good artist. Nothing can fake being a good artist. And, and that is one of like my main jealousies in life. I mean, I'm not a jealous in a, in a bad way, but one of the things that I wish I was I was good at. Um, am I good? Am I, am, I, am I a good artist? Am I creative? Sure. Come on, dude. Am I creative? Am I a good artist? Sure. But am I a natural artist with the ability to draw anything and, and, and see colors a certain way? Absolutely not. All right. I'm going to get a tuna sandwich from Subway because the diet begins today. No cheese. No toasted. Uh, spinach. Uh, cucumber pickle, green pepper, and jalapenos, please. Now, Judith has me on this new device that she bought for herself to keep that body tight, you know what I'm saying? And I am, I don't know what it is or what it's supposed to do, but it like, I kind of feel like what it's supposed to be doing. It like, I feel like my muscles contracting a little bit, and I never, I never believe in infomercials like this, but I've been on it for like, how long? By now, we're about to spend some money to get some push. Camera stuff. 
Camera, drone, all that. We've got my camera guy here. It's on sale for a limited time only. That's what we need. Every single time I'm in here, I literally have to force myself to not buy everything in the store. That and the fact that I can't afford it. This camera here, Nate Shot said that takes amazing pictures. This is the one that Justine has. He said that it's super dope for vlogging. I just can't, I just can't get myself to get away from this camera because the lens shrinks into it and I can put it in my pocket. We're getting that today. We, it, I think it's time. Look at that. Hi, man, this is Rachel. She can take Rachel. care of all your camera stuff. The service here is like amazing. I like coming here because, wait, I'm in the, I like coming here because they literally like do their, I mean obviously it's their job to sell stuff, but I do think that they actually care. This is the one that shoots in 4K, right? Yes. It's ready to go? Mm -hmm. You're not gonna upsell me on the backpack? Sometimes there's a deal with the backpack. Oh, cool. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, no, I get it. No, uh, that, that's obviously something that we'll, that we'll sit down and, and, and draw a plan around. Uh, something's wrong with this camera. I've dropped it way too many times. Last time being just recently at the at the store. Unfortunately, they didn't have the camera that we needed at that Best Buy. I bought the drone. Now I'm headed over to the store in Downers Grove. If I wasn't on a diet, I would be very, very, very tempted to go visit my friend at the taco spot. Anywhere. Anywhere. Got it. There we go. Have a good one. All right. Like if I leaked something that wasn't supposed to be leaked and you kicked me out of my office? Yeah. <laughs> this takes, this takes, it'll be the best sticks ever. Are you live right now? No. Damn near everyone that's ever had any sort of success in the COD uh, content side of things. Yo, he... I've this guy call with Justin. <laughs> just talked to Hector about... Did you hear that? Sorry, what was it? Somebody was just... <laughs> Somebody was just no, yelling. He just heard us laugh. <laughs> Literally, right before, when they asked him about me, he said, it's like, oh, you know, he's fucking hating every moment of it, and then he said it. At this point in time, we're just waiting for the battery to charge, and the second that it's done, we are out there. We're going outside, and the thing I'm sure about yet is whether or not we're going to have pr problems with the neighbors, because this is like a pretty high-end neighborhood, um, and if there's anything that I know about rich people is that they like their privacy. Um, so we're gonna see. Maybe we get some complaints. Maybe we get the cops called on us. We'll see. Maybe they'll just think that we're flying a drone and they won't know that that there's a camera attached to it. Hitch and I are sitting here. Well, I'm eating, but Hitch and I are sitting here talking about Hitch is playing with this new toy. Um, we're talking about like if anybody ever sits down and just talks to us about our vlog. And the second he said that, it 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 like transported me. I was like, sure I had to be with. Okay. Right. And as soon as I walk in, he's like. He's like, hey, is that the suit without the button? And I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> and he's like, oh yeah, man, I've been watching your vlogs like this whole time. And I'm like, oh fuck. But it was the weirdest <laughs> shit, bro. It was like executive. Damn. He's like, yeah, he's like, hey man, sorry we couldn't. I brought the squad, except for Hitch because he wasn't fast enough. But I brought the, I brought the squad some coffee. Oh, oh, the reason that I'm not watching any of the searches is because I know that we're about to start traveling. France, uh, London, you know what I'm saying? So I got to make sure that I have entertainment Ooh, that's what I to do power. it. Yeah. That's why I'm not. You can't watch Power on the plane, bro. Is it about plane stuff? Huh? Where is it about? Why can't you watch it on the plane? There's a lot of nakedness. Oh, is there? Yeah. It's not that much. Yeah, it is. Isn't there? Like no, bro, there's a lot of boning in there. Him and Angela, him and his wife, his wife walks around with no shirt on. Yeah, she don't know what's up. Is she wife. good? Oh, no. Come on, man, you're not gonna save enough for the podcast? No. All right, it's time to make the donuts, AKA time to get to work, AKA time to, for Hitch to press two buttons and sit there <laughs> and get paid. Um. 
Overpaid ass little kid, huh? <laughs> I'm excited, man. I, we, we haven't done a podcast in like, it feels like almost two weeks. And it kind of is almost two weeks, but we're not going to miss again. Woohoo! Knock on wood. Knock on wood. Chicago weather here's you and they're gonna play against you. I'm in New York again uh, in two weeks. Behind the scenes pre-recording session looks like you have, come on, dude, you're doing that too much, man. <laughs> it's getting like it's annoying. It's just whatever's it's just, it's, 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 it's in the back, fucking dab it in the back. <laughs> I'm not even annoyed by it. I'm I just, like, I don't I even like heard the noise and I was like, I have to. No, you don't. It's like a tick now. <laughs> yeah, I don't know why you do that, but like everybody's starting to complain. Uh, anyway, so this is what the pre-recording session looks like. I have to run some audio test. More than likely, we're not going to have the uh, the noise gates figured out because weather issues uh, prevented me from being here to do that. Um, are you guys ready to do this? I'm so pumped, dude. Are you? Uh, it feels like we haven't done one in a long time. It's been too damn long. Too damn long. I find this therapeutic and, Same. and, and, and like, I agree. watch the podcast. It's going up today. On the Optic Nation channel, check out the Twitter information for. Just go to Optic Gaming. It's gonna be live. I retweet it. They're gonna retweet it. It's gonna be live. Uh, what time? Are you, what's the time it's going live? Uh, two. It's going live at two p.m. Central, so three Eastern, twelve Pacific for you LAans. Are we talking about the? No, no, no. Okay. Well, don't, Why? don't, Why? don't do that on camera. <laughs> All right, so we just got the recording of the podcast. Unfortunately. That quit. I have a license for it, okay? But for some reason, it, it recorded the whole thing, and then when we went to render, it crashed completely. And we sat there looking at it for like five minutes, <clears throat> and uh, we were gonna try to figure out whether or not uh, if if there was a way to save whatever progress had been made. Uh, and unfortunately, we we couldn't salvage it. Uh, I mean, it's right here, like this thing right here. It's that's it right there. Podcast episode three. That file for the life of me is not opening. I called my guy and he couldn't open it. Um, luckily, the audio from these cameras are good enough. Those cameras are good enough that it's going to be able to be uploaded. You're going to be able to hear it. The quality, Mike, is the the quality of the audio is not going to be as good as it was in previous weeks. Uh, but the podcast needed to get out. There was literally nothing that was going to stop us from getting this podcast up. A second time because of the delays that we've had uh and, and it almost feels as though everything was working against the podcast as my vlog from yesterday said still felt that way today because look at the audio problems that we had it, it was it was not it was nothing good it was nothing short of bad therefore we're just going to upload it the way it is because it's about the content not the quality of the content because it's about you guys receiving a podcast no matter what the audio is. Listen, if one time we're not home, we're gonna record on a, on a toaster, we're giving you that, that podcast. Uh, anyway, the good thing is that we're literally close to five days away from, from doing the, the next podcast, so you guys aren't gonna have to wait that long to hear another one. Um, and from what I've been seeing in the comments, you guys want more than one podcast a week. I mean, shit, if that's what you guys want, that's what you guys will get. It's gonna suck for Hitch because he's the one that will be edited, but that's what he gets paid for. Yo, cut. Is that we good? I mean, as good as it's gonna get. It's not great. It's not. It's not what. It was gonna be. I mean, that was the best podcast we had done for sure. Yeah. Now, if the audio, okay, look, it's still gonna be the great, uh, the best podcast we ever done, but the audio is not gonna be as good a quality. Well, yeah, that's what I mean. The quality of the audio is not gonna be as good. But the content is still going to be the best content that we've done so far. Yeah, you know, actually, that's what we talked about in the podcast is you don't need high quality. Yeah, fuck that. It was the story to be told. And it got told, that story. All right, I'll see you tomorrow. All right. All right, and that's where I'll end it with a nice positive. Wait a minute. I can't end it yet. I got to pack all my stuff.
Alright, just got another message from the airline. Instead of being half an hour delayed, 